So Dr. Lind Lindwe is a Bolawayo best doctor in Zimbabwe. He has developed an AI tool for identifying cervical cancer. Almost 60%, uh, in fact, almost 90% sensitivity, which means you can identify almost 90% of all cervical cancer cells. And he developed this tool as part of his uh, thesis and is already in use. Uh, he lost his aunt, Miss Nomsa Yamini, to cervical cancer in 2016 and decided to research cervical cancer. So this is an amazing young doctor from Zimbabwe who has developed this AI tool. Uh, and he is very, very qualified, much uh, a graduate from the University of Zimbabwe, and he rece received the Vice Chancellor's Award for this work in his degree in bio biochemical engineering. And he's also a doctor, as I said. So amazing stuff. We'll try to find him and make this happen. So cervical cancer is caused uh, by human papilloma virus, HPV. So let me just say HPV before Naruma, <laughs> my tongue. <laughs> so it's caused by HPV. It affects both boys and girls. But the girls end up with cervical cancer. I don't know what happens to the boys. And normally what you need to do is to take a vaccine. If I, the young girls must take an HPV vaccine. Yesterday, I was talking to a young girl. Well, she's a young woman. I think she's in her 40s. She had cervical cancer. And she got treated. Uh, so imagine, I think she's about 30. She had cervical cancer. So anyone can get cervical cancer. It doesn't matter how old you are. And you must do a test every year. So now if you're in Zimbabwe, now that there is this tool, which does this uh, checking, which is done by Mr. Uh, Dr. Nube here, we then need to make sure that this is uh, pushed out to as many people as possible. Early detection is critical. If you've got cells that are abnormal and they're discovered within a year, then that can be sorted. But if it becomes cancer, then it can be sorted. And so it's important for a woman to know in time about cervical cancer, a very dangerous disease. Once you catch it, it eats you up. Uh, and cancer is very, very dangerous. So try to do as much as possible. Every year, a woman should go and do a cancer screening. And also avoid multiple partners. Uh, that is one of the things. Teach the boys and the girls to avoid multiple partners.